Hey traders, Jose Tormos here, FX MVP with Market Traders Institute. And today I'm going to show you what trading session is best to trade for those of you who are a little bit more active in the markets, who don't want to wait on trades to fulfill. And for those of you who also are a little bit slower in the markets, want that time to go ahead and wait for the market to fulfill that trade setup. Today we're going to take a look at two different trade sessions to show you the volatility and lack of volatility to help you make a decision when you go live and trade these markets, which ultimately is going to be your decision on what type of trader you are. And by showing you this example, hopefully you'll make a decision faster and get you back on track for 2017 being one of your most profitable Forex years ever. So come join me in the markets here as I show you real quickly what this means. Um, on this particular day, to give you an example, this is the dollar Japanese yen on a 15 minute time frame. And what you're looking at here is a nice trending environment, a lot of volatility in the market. It's the active zone. Uh, it's the European session towards the beginning of the US session. And what you see is a beautiful downtrend movement. You can practice counter trend line breaks, all sorts of great opportunities here. Here's where the market begins to rally and retrace towards that upside at the end of the active zone for the day. Now, why is that? Well, the reason for that is because the market now is transitioning into what is called the dead zone. On the dead zone, again, is the same currency pair, but just a little bit a couple hours later, and check out the difference. The market here is moving sideways. This is where traders begin to make mistakes. They begin to think the market's in a climb and it's stuck in a range because of the dead zone. Slower, a little bit less activity happening, but for those of you that are looking to have proper equity management, having slower trade setups develop, the dead zone's gonna be a perfect place for you to trade because it allows you to go ahead and properly set up your trades and get ready for the next active zone to take place to fulfill those movements. So don't be discouraged by the direction of the active zone, the speed of it compared to the dead zone. They are beautiful combinations in your trading, but your personality will gravitate towards one or the other. And when you see which one that is, it's gonna take you to the next level of trading, I promise you. Just keep things easy to understand, easy to execute, easy to obey. And at the end of the day, that's really what it's all about. Just keeping things simple, fun, and trading needs to be financially fulfilling and rewarding. Otherwise, why do it, right? So folks, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Come join me in my live sessions here this week, and I'll teach you more about this coming up in the next Forex webinars. This is Jose Tormos, FXMVP. I'll see you at the top.